thrilling reality of manned space exploration. Travel through more than 50 years of dreams and ambition, the efforts and the will of those who opened the doors to the universe for us all. Welcome to their dreams and accomplishments. Welcome to NASA, a human adventure. The uh, reason behind uh, this exhibition is the human element, the most important one. That's why we have focused on dreamers and pioneers and go fever, because that's what the people relate to. You will learn about those who looked to the sky and imagined space travel long before it was possible. Those who seeded the minds of generations worldwide with the idea of space exploration, the dreamers. Some of the objects that are presented in this exhibition are uh, quite unique, to say the least. It took us uh, a little while to choose them, and we paid attention and focused on the objects that were never shown before to the public. You actually see real you know, pieces from space. Uh, there's dings in the metal from actually being used, like you're literally looking at history right there. Understand how the launch of Sputnik in 1957 caught Americans off guard. Learn about the Cold War, the rivalry between the two titans, the United States and the Soviet Union. I believe that this nation should commit itself to achieving the goal before this decade is out of landing a man on the moon and returning him safely to the earth. On July 20th, 1969, Apollo 11 astronaut Neil Armstrong made the first ever moonwalk the greatest teamwork project in the history of mankind. There's a wonderful model of the command module that took us to the moon, where I spent three days inside uh, with two other guys. To see where they were in these small little capsules with these little windows, you get the sense of what the astronauts felt and what they were dealing with and all the knobs and the buttons they have in front of them. Being able to imagine being in a capsule, being an astronaut, is kind of scary and impressive. It's something for superheroes. Explore the innumerable devices that needed to be invented for man's survival in space. How, how do they eat? How do they go to the bathroom? How do they stay warm? Well, lo que más me ha gustado ha sido ver todos esos trajes de astronautas. As early as the beginning of the 20th century and in key areas all around the world, some of the greatest scientific minds were studying how to leave the Earth behind with rocket power. Learn how these pioneers made space flight a reality and see a large model of the largest and most powerful rocket ever launched, the Saturn V. Yo recomendaría especialmente esta exposición a niños y adolescentes para que puedan comprender de una forma directa la aplicación práctica de las de las ciencias físicas y matemáticas. It has a wonderful way of encouraging uh, young children to uh, reach for the stars and uh, to aim high. Witness the evolution of five decades of manned space missions, from the Mercury capsule to the space shuttle Atlantis. Me encanta de la Atlantis. When I grow up, I want to fly it. Esos paracaídas tan inmensos que no te haces una idea que fuera una cosa tan grande. I'm just beyond impressed with what we've been able to achieve in the past 50 years, and it makes you hopeful for the next 50 years and what we can do then. Take a look at the present and future of space exploration, the Hubble telescope, and its astounding discoveries in recent years. No sabía que se había hecho tantas cosas en el espacio. Y lo que nos falta por saber todavía. Hay muchas cosas que quedan por saber. All adventures are stories of successes, but also stories of tragedies. NASA, a human adventure, pays tribute to the brave few who gave their lives in pursuit of such an extraordinary dream. I was surprised to, to hear all, this, all these stories. It's very emotional for me. It is a, a, a tremendous uh, uh, exhibition. It's probably the best I've seen. Hemos realizado 600 kilómetros para ver hoy la exposición de la NASA en Madrid. Porque solo se puede ver una vez en la vida. Enjoy scheduled conferences and talks from NASA personalities who have lived and participated in the early stages of space exploration. El hecho de que te lo cuente una persona que vivió todo esto, que trabajó en todos estos proyectos, con su experiencia y, y la pasión con la que te lo cuenta, pues te llega mucho más y es muy muy interesante. Take advantage of state-of-the-art audio guides available in all languages that will guide you through the entire exhibition from one item to the next. Try the life of a test pilot and experience multiple G-forces. The set footage, it's the icing on top of the cake. It's a, it's a wow at the end of the exhibition. It was, it was turning all the time. It was like I was in a real movie. A customized exhibition of a local space agency, ground tracking station or institution can be displayed at the exhibition. 
When we were designing and creating this exhibition, we reserved an area for the local space agency so they could use uh, this exhibition as an opportunity to convey a message to the public about what they are doing in terms of exploration. This exhibit is so important that I hope that it travels around the world. Even in the very small countries because everyone need to have the chance to dream. I don't think there's anything like this even in America. It's fantastic. Incredible. Fun, super fun. Impactante. Sorprendente. Eh, emocionante. Espectacular. Futuro. Amazing. Impressive. I want to come back with my friends. It was and it is an adventure, a human adventure, and the adventure continues.